before they go dynamiting the current college football playoff to make room for what they say will be a better version there is something worth considering. Why are we trusting the architects of that first disaster to get anything right? Presumably, they'll just mess up again. The four-team playoff format is ruining college football for everyone except a few brand name schools, not that a certain team in the state of Alabama is complaining, but what if this proposed 12-team version isn't much better? Or, and this is so much worse, yal, but hear me out, what if a 12-team playoff makes it easier for some undeserving group of five school to reach the playoff over more deserving teams in the Power 5 conferences? No, nah and nope, right? Can't have that. What if 13-0 Memphis makes the playoff over 11-2 Ole Miss? I can't even believe I'm about to write this, but what if 13-0 UAB makes a 12-team college football playoff over 10-2 Alabama? See how insane this is all starting to sound? Love UAB to death, but there should never be a scenario where UAB could make a 12-team playoff over a two-loss team in the SEC. And if that day comes, well, I guess y'all can find me down at lose buying people shots of tequila. How did we get here? Someone really messed up, that's how. In the real world, someone would be fired if they screwed up a thing so badly as the current college football playoff. The problem with it is that it's not only rigged, but it's rigged way too well. Only Alabama, Ohio State, Clemson and a few other schools realistically now have access to it. Given a choice, the best high school prospects in the country want to play at a school that's going to, more than likely, make the playoffs. Well, there are only four spots, and Alabama and Clemson get one every year. People like me have been saying super teams would ruin college football for years and years, and now here we are. Before we start over, shouldn't everyone who messed up so badly be replaced? Logically, that makes so much more sense than what's happening, which is this, they're letting the guys who screwed up the first time take another crack at making up their own rules again so they can juice it better the next time. They say the proposal for an expanded playoff isn't anywhere near finalized and that it's not happening until at least 2023. That's great news, too. There is still time to fire everyone and get this thing right. Let me ask an obvious question. Why expand to just 12 teams, as originally suggested earlier this summer, when including as many teams in the playoffs as possible makes more sense? Obviously if the playoff is going to be expanded to include 12 teams, then 16 would actually be better. This is so open and shut to any fully functioning doorknob for a brain that it's ridiculous to even consider anything else.